What is going on, everybody out there? This is Brent Abel, GoldBallHunting.com. That young buck over there with the red round glasses, the great Jeff Jacklich. And uh, we've got another episode of the Gold Ball Hunting Podcast for you today. We're still working through the backhand volley. And uh, we're going to talk about our man, Mr. Rich Krinks, today. Yeah, Rich! <laughs> so, guys, hang in there to the end of this episode because we got something very cool we wanna, that we want to talk about. So the big question is this, how are tennis players like us who never played in the tour, weren't incredible juniors, or maybe got a late start to the game, how do we consistently compete at our highest skill level without having to grind through endless hours of encore practice time and still be in the hunt for victory match after match? That is the question, and Gold Ball Hunting gives you the answers by helping you eliminate your skill level range so that you build a strong foundation of confidence. My name is Brent Abel, and along with my biz partner, Jeff Jacklich, welcome to Gold Ball Hunting. Well, Jeffrey, what is going on there, dude? Well, uh, let's see. Uh, we are just uh, coming out of the, uh, you know, forced planned power outage here in the Napa Valley because of high winds and all that good stuff. <laughs> so, P yeah. PGD, thank you very much. Yes. Yeah, it's been a... Let's. I'm going to use a really polite word. It's been a circus. <laughs> okay. <laughs> As opposed to a something show. That's great. Yeah. Yes. Um, all right. Well, listen. Yeah, I mean, most of not most, but some of California, they decide to shut up the power because they're concerned about the winds and fire. And I get it. That's fine. So protecting us. That's cool. Just a little um, inconvenient now and then. But we're still working. We're still working. No power. We're still working. Technology. Hot spotting the phone. <laughs> that away. That away. We're Good. doing it. All right. We're doing it. So, guys, listen. Here's what's been going on in the last week or so. We, Jeff and I have been yakking about the backhand volley. Been sharing stories about uh, uh, the pathetic Brent Abel backhand volley back in the day. <laughs> as a player and as a coach. And then I've... You know, for the, luckily for the rest of everyone else out there, I got together with Tom Stowe, and that uh, that kind of cleared up the mystery of the backhand volley. But um, guys, yesterday we actually uh, opened up a new course. Jeff and I opened up a new course for the backhand volley, loaded with a couple of bonuses. A couple, man, like what three or four bonuses in there? Yeah, that uh, it's a great instructional package. And um, today, yeah. today I want to. And so, guys, if you've not picked up this package, right down below. If you're on YouTube, there's a link. Click it. And you got to make sure you get inside this thing because it, uh, the offer ends this coming Sunday, October 13th, 11 p.m. Pacific, when all the little pieces go back to the retail price and, you know, the great deal is off the table. Uh, because it's such a great deal that uh, we can't do this forever. Anyway, let's talk about Rich Cranks. He's our boy from Alameda, California, who's a... I played Rich uh, at Pacific, the Pacific Coast this year. I think it was my first round match. He, he won a match. I got a bye. And we played good 4-5 lefty. He and I are actually in the same, on the same team, USDA team, that's right. going, to, uh, it's going to Florida in February playing the national. I think it's a 9-0 combo. Anyway. Nice. Yeah, good guy. Really good guy. And just absolutely is so passionate about tennis. And... Um, so, Jeff, have you got if you got his little uh, comment that he made uh, recently about about the backhand volley? Go ahead and and show that. You want me to read the whole thing, or, yeah, or just yeah, just read whatever Rich said. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. So he goes. Uh, I listened to the to the podcast today on the backhand volley. You guys were cracking me up, so you know our material's still good there. So, uh, but seriously, I hit on the ball machine tonight, and I was trying to visualize Brent on a bar stool hitting volleys. Um, then I tried to think of me on a bar stool and actually hit a ton of backhand volleys. Eureka and aha! <laughs> I think I got what you guys were talking about. Posture, baby. Yeah, yeah, that's it right there. Well, look, and then that's that's the one thing that you and I've been talking about the whole time for the last week is that all the other stuff, stroke technique, what you do with grip, what you do with racket prep, the framework, what you do with pre-contact swing path contact point and then where's the finish all that you can throw out the window if you don't have the one thing which is posture and balance and right. and you know for me the story goes is yeah i mean mr stool mr stool mr stowe 
Mr. Stowe put me on that on that bar stool, and and my life literally changed, Jeff. I mean, now all of a sudden, wow. Well, that thing I can check off. That now, not, now I can actually become a little bit better player with that. There are a couple yeah. other things we had to work through, but um, <laughs> but dang. So uh, it's fun to hear, and it's great to read other guys, other gals when they have epiphanies, aha moments, as uh, uh, as Rich did, in and and simply just kind of finding that that uh, posture and balance. So, guys, we want to help you do that as well inside this package that Jeff and I are offering. Today is Friday, uh, the 11th of uh, October. And um, so it's, it's going to be open for a couple more days, and then we're going we're gonna to shut it down for a while. So, Jeff, what, right yeah. down below? Is that where it is? It's right down below YouTube. It's somewhere. Right down below. <laughs> it's some yeah, it's down there somewhere. iTunes, Stitcher, there. you can find it's it. iTunes. Stitcher, all that stuff. Well, I wanted to, I wanted to say a circle back really quick on Rich. Yeah. I'm going to spend some time with him next week on the court. Good deal. So it's going to be a lot of fun. That's yeah, great. Yeah, yeah. So I'm, I'm looking forward to getting him out there and um, and see if we can't really like get the whole aha. Like, get, get, take the aha to the total beam of light enlightenment, you know, moment. You know. Yeah. Well, look. I mean, <laughs> look. If you, if you're going to get him that good, then if he beats me in next year's Pacific Coast. I might be a little pissed, Jeff. Well, you know, you may have just found your new doubles partner. <laughs> <laughs> That's true, too. <laughs> he, is, he is a nasty lefty, so. Nasty lefty, baby. Um, um, anyway, yes, what do we want? What do we like? What we, we like, like to all. find we folks like to do right now. We have a very short short yes. episode today of the podcast, only because we don't want to waste your guys' time. We want to get you in this course. If you haven't already done yep. it, then, look, don't wait. Don't get hesitate. There. Get it done. Plus, We've got this 100% GBH, Gold Ball Hunting, Player Satisfaction Guarantee. Yeah. Your $37 is not at risk. So, Bumski. Yeah. All right, what do we anyway, want to find folks to do, Jeff? Uh, like us, share us, please subscribe. Let us know what you think down below. iTunes and Stitcher, rate and review. Goldballhunting.com. Send it to a friend. Send it to your doubles partner. Spread the word. Out of the way. Out of the way. Oh, that was a good one. That was one of your better ones right there. Guys, with that, get out there today. And I'm going to get out there today before the snow hits. Uh, the snow hits. And who knows? It could be It could be a winter wonderland. Anyway, guys, get out there. Help someone else have a great day. Jeff will do this again tomorrow. I can't wait.